Hello everyone, B Cross here, and today's personal order is kill 75 enemies using the Motar Sentry. Oof, I think this is gonna take this one will take a while. I think I'm gonna take it somewhere a little bit easier and take it on a lower difficulty. So we'll see. I'm gonna take it on the bug set as well since it's gonna kill a uh, number of kills this uh personal order. So for primary, we're gonna go with our usual. Let's see. Scenery breaker for crowd control. For secondary, I think, let's see. I'm going to stick with the grenade. I'm going to go with the shotgun. The bushwhacker. And throwables, we're going to go with the incendiary impact. Because we're going to go for more high kills and crowd control. And for our armor, we're going to do probably a smaller map. So we're going to have to do a, lot, a heavier armor. I think we'll go medium. Let's see. Maybe I'll go drill master for extra nades. Now the planet, the mission we're doing, we're going to do the high evacuate high value assets. This is a defend planet one because this will have a lot more bugs in one area. So for stratagems, what we're going to go with is first the Motar Sentry since that's the personal order. And for crowd control, we're going to go with the flamethrower. As well as, I'm going to go with the 380. It's one of my favorites. As well as the Napalm Airstrike. Let's see. Now for our enhancement. I think I'm going to go with the Space Pod. The Help Pod Space Optimization. Just to make sure we're always maxed out on nades. Because I'm going to be using that a lot for crowd control. So the strategy here. It's basically, we're going to try to... Base it. It's... We're basically running the mission. There's not much to, to uh, strategize here. So we're going to take advantage of the choke points. We'll toss our Motar Sentry into places where they're less likely to go to. It usually attracts their attention, but we're going to hide it like around corners. Now, it looks like we have this map. So there's going to be two different entrances. And we'll have a good amount of choke points here. Now, this is... On hell dive, or this is on difficulty nine, so it's gonna be a lot easier. Let's go on and start set up our resupplies and getting all of our, getting our flamethrower out, and then let's close both of these gates right here just to slow them down a little bit. Let's see. There we go, and then I'm gonna go ahead and set up my motor up here. I probably should have set it up earlier so they uh, cool down. Reduce this a lot quicker. But where I like to, for this specific map, I like to toss my motor sentry over here in the corner. Because over here it has a pretty wide range and it's and bugs are less likely to go over there. They they're more likely to skip it and go straight to the next gate. Sometimes they'll go to it, but sometimes they'll skip it. So let's see. We still have 20 seconds left. We have a lot of time could manually start it but then that walking there and walking back will just be 20 seconds so the motor over here is going to focus more on the left side i think i'm going to hide up here it's like a high ground spot maybe i'll be able to like lure them towards me but the problem is the motor is going to end up shooting me <clears throat> all right so right now i don't really have much to do until they break a gate you know i think what i'm going to do is going to leave this gate Let's see. I'm gonna leave this gate closed and open up this gate over here. And then I'm gonna engage over here to protect this side while my motor defends the other side. So here. You now I'm just gonna use a napalm strike. What I wanna do is constantly use it. The napalm strike should defend that side pretty well. As long as oh, I blew myself up. Well, that's unfortunate. I need to go grab my flamethrower because that is my crowd control. Oh, I can't go around this rock. I'm going to run in and grab my flamethrower and see if I can make sure I can protect my motor sentry. Okay, fortunately, they haven't destroyed that gate yet. There we go. I have an extra gun now, so I guess I need to... In case my gun runs out and I don't have any reset supplies close by, I could just swap guns. Let's see. It looks like... The motor is defending that side. It's pretty. It's doing well because all the bot, the all the bugs are getting to one spot, so it could blow it up. So 
We got a good amount of kills already. Let's go ahead and toss our napalm trick over here. So what I'm doing is I'm tossing it in front so they have to walk through it. But I need to stay further away from them because they're gonna... The Mozart sentry might end up hitting me. <clears throat> so now that I'm thinking about it, the 380 might not have been a great choice. Go and take care of this guy. I think what I should have done was a gas strike. So I have two different crowd control stratagems. So I can alternate between them. I guess what would have been good is something that doesn't need to be resupplied. If we have to use up all our stratagems before the eagles end up going bad. So I'm gonna have, a laser would have been good here as well. A laser may not have been good here. It would have destroyed our gates. It's off my napalm strike right there. My motors ready to be resetted. We're set up back here in the corner. But definitely doing a good job protecting that gate. But I need to make sure they don't break it. So I'm gonna try and prevent this side from breaking it from the this from over here. While my motor takes care of the other side. So basically the plan here is once they destroy this gate, I'm gonna close the other gate and then defend this side. But for the most part, I think the Motar is going to attack the ones that are closer, so I'm gonna have to move my Motar. Once this gate is broken. So basically I could defend one side while my Motar takes care of the other. Now you could use multiple strat uh, multiple strat uh sentries for this one. But I think the Motar does last the longest versus any other one. And it hits a wider area. Since we're doing lower difficulty, it's a lot more smaller bugs. I'm gonna have to toss my incinerary nades here because I ran out of or my uh, evil airstrikes haven't reset it yet. The reason why I chose this armor is for the uh, nades. And just basically a crowd control type setup. The Drop some bullets here. Why not? I have a lot of resupplies back there, so I think we're good. I think it's doing really good right now. we we'll take the high ground. We're almost, we're almost done. I think we'll pretty, we'll finish pretty soon. I'm gonna toss another resupply back here as backup. So this is doing good, and I'm gonna go over here. See, my nade pump's almost up. There we go. I'm gonna toss my nades for now, and then probably in the next breach, I'll use a nade pump strike. I survived. I guess survived the nades. There won't be too many heavy units. The only issues we'll run into is probably the charger. Because it's gonna it's just gonna bum rush the gates. Alright, let's see. How's it going? My motor sentry still there? Yep, it's still there. There's just a little gap between the breaches. Which is good. So I have my Backup breaker right there. I'm gonna toss my eagle airstrike here when the breach pops up. Or are they all on that side? My Motar sentry is almost up as well. It's always a charger. Oh, I don't have stuns. I'm gonna see if I can snipe him before it rushes. Oh. What? Why didn't he run past me? See if I can land on it and pick up my uh. going on let me pick up my uh flamethrower but bugs over here on this side i think my motor hasn't oh i need to set up reset it up let's just clear up all of these guys right here for the here's the next breach so we need to get that set up right away looks like they broke the gate so i'm gonna have to move i need to close this other gate over here while the sentry protects this side first i'm gonna toss the napalm right there so they don't get too far in Grab my flamethrower here and close this gate. Keep them a little bit. Oh, they're too close to me. All oh, the Molotar is going to hit me. I think we're good. I'm going to go see if I can snipe them from up here. Oh! 
I have the auto climb on. That's unfortunate. This is gonna destroy the gate. Oh, it did. I don't know what destroyed the gate. I don't know if the bugs destroyed the gate or the motor. I feel like this gate went down way faster than the other gate. I'm gonna toss my eagle airstrike right here. Protect it. Protect the area. Then I think I have to start pushing back. I need to start protecting this choke point over here. Alright, let's see. Look at these guys. Airstrike needs to uh, reset. For now, I could just keep work on crowd control over here. There we go. Right here is a good spot. So I think we could protect this area pretty easily. The breach. Take care of these guys since they're too close to me. The motor is going to end up hitting me. Oh. I need the motor to aim downward. Toss a 380. Just try to toss it over there. I really should have done something. I really don't think this was a good choice. I usually use a 380 for the bot side. Oh, it looks like something destroyed it or it ended or finished. Alright, now I have to manually defend all of this right here. Use my flamethrower to basically burn everything down whoa hunters what's going on oh this let's see how am i gonna deal with this can't see anything house nades just trying to set up fire barriers here just oh what i didn't think i was gonna go this far out but I can't see anything. I have no idea where I'm landing. Am I in the base? Oh yeah, I am in the base. I can see my flamethrower. That's fortunate. Pick that up. I think I'm gonna have to push back a little bit because I can't see anything. I'm gonna close this one just in just for backup, just in case. Set my motor up here around this corner. And then I'll probably jump down to uh protect from the inside. Also, also a napalm strike there. Maybe it'll prevent a lot i need to make sure there's nothing on the oh that was a bad throw i need to make sure there's nothing at the gate oh there are stuff at the gate destroy the gate don't destroy the gate oh oh i think that destroyed the gate what how did my other gate survive so long this gate just died really quickly too i cannot see anything but now i'm just gonna be using nades Try to put try to toss nades into that choke point. Yeah, see, I, remember, I see a lot of my resupplies here, so I can start picking these guys up. Just start tossing nades everywhere. Until this lets up, I cannot see what's going on. Put toss it right there, right at the choke point. Maybe I'll protect for a while. Let's see. It looks like our mission is complete. Oh, it's charger. Take care of this guy. Like oh, turn around. Face me. There we go. There we go. Oh, they're calling their breaches right here now. Oh, there's too many, too many hunters. I'm gonna need to back up. That's a strike right here. Oh, this charger's body. Take care of all these guys before the motors end up hitting me instead. Someone hitting it? Oh, no, it's not. Alright, now it's gonna start getting dicey here because we're a little too close to the generators. Let's see, I could toss a backup flamethrower over here. See if we keep crowd control over here. We are pushing the bugs back a bit, so that's good. Oh, I have no shadow gems yet. Nippon would be good right now. 
I'm just gonna head down here and let's go and kill this guy. So I use my nades to crowd control this choke point. Since there's still a lot of resupplies over here, I could just use these guys. It's looking good so far. I throw my 380 since it's resetted. Let me just clear this up real quick. Oh, I think my... I think my uh, motor is up. Yep. Reset this guy. We need this guy going. Oh, hunters. I need my motor just constantly helping out because that's what's really help, helping keep the population under control. Or the number of bugs under control. Oh, they're getting really close to the generator. Oh. Glad I got that stim off. They're attacking it. You need to start clearing these guys up. Oh, we just need one more. That's an orbital force it all the way down there. Where's my motor? We go get some stims real quick. All right. So what I need to do is do this from the side. I can't like aim directly at it, or it's gonna end up destroying. President have a lot of health. That's cleared up. Now I can go back worrying about the choke point. All oh, perfect. Mission complete. All right, so let's go ahead and get out of here. What was that? A charger? Get out of here. And get up here. Get the high ground. And shoot them from here. Be able to get the charger right here. Maybe we could get it to block the stairs. Nope. There we go. See, I don't see any bugs. There they are. I don't think it matters anymore since we were 40 finished the mission. So they're just going to go to target the generators. So I think from here, I'm just going to see toss an eagle airstrike right here. Then I'm going to head out. So this is probably one of the better missions to complete this specific objective in one quick go because it does have a lot of bugs in one area so it does have a lot of splash damage now you could do this on a lot of different maps you could do this on the eradicate missions as well but that one gets a lot more dicey what i like about this one there's a choke point where you can easily protect this mission is a lot easier on the lower difficulties but on the higher difficulties once the bio titans are introduced that's when it gets really difficult it is you can solo it, but it's still very difficult. It's better to do this one in groups. So this is so this is today's personal order. Thanks everyone for watching. Goodbye.